the channel. Today I have a food haul. So today I went to a different market um, that we don't we used to go to, but we haven't in a long while. It's very cheap. I was like, holy crap! I expected over a hundred dollars, and I had put stuff aside. I was like, well, let's not buy this just yet. I want to see how much the other stuff costs. And then I put it all together, and it was only like ninety-five dollars. I was like, holy moly! So. This week we didn't have too, too much money because of this pandemic and unemployment and all this sh stupid stuff. So let me show you what we got here. All right, guys. So this is only a half a week. And this is a week where I have my mom's birthday's Monday. So tomorrow, Sunday, we'll be having her party and I need to make cake, which I already had the cake stuff, but I told her I'd promised her a pudding that she loves, that she usually would have on the last day of school, but she didn't come because of the pandemic, and now she can be with us, so I told her I'd make her the sand pudding that I usually make on last day of school. So, you'll see that ingredients in here. So, we're also doing a cake for her. I'm going to make it look like a pineapple, and you use the top half of the pineapple. Um, so, that's why I got that. We do love pineapple as well. Emma was excited she could get her watermelon juice that she always used to beg me to get at this market. Um, so, then we got milk. We've got, she begged me for this today, some strawberry syrup, uh, the pudding. I didn't know how much to get, so I grabbed four. Um, it might be two of these, I think, makes the amount that I usually make. Um, because I usually would get, like, a family size, you know, of regular pudding. Some more bananas. I need bananas in my life. Um, I'm low on potassium, and that's an easy way to have it. Um, ricotta cheese. Oh, and then for, I need to make a dinner. I have a friend, um, who is ill. And I'm making her a dinner for her and her children for Tuesday. So Monday we'll make it, let it cool down, put it in the fridge, and Tuesday I'll deliver it for them. Um, and I, I saw these and I said, let's get some more of these snacks in the house. They like the sticks with the cheese, and then I got the pretzel sticks with the cheese. Oreos is for the pudding to make like sand with, you'll see, some other cookies I have. Some more Cosmic Brownies. ZD is for... I got two boxes of ZD. Um, oh, I didn't get the foil pan. I'll go get that at Dollar Tree. Um, we're making big ZD for that family. Emma needed more mac and cheese. Um, they have three children. Um, <clears throat> and it was kind of cute because the oldest, who's like, I think, 14 or so, um, or 13, um... I want to say 14. She said, when I asked, what kind of stuff does she want for dinner? What do they like, the kids? Or what do they don't like? Um, and this teenager said, brownies! So, I'm going to make brownies with it so she can have her brownies. Um, they're a really nice family. So I got us some sandwich bags. This is to go with the pudding. Nilla wafers you mix with the Oreos crushed up to make like sand. Um, <clears throat> Emma was so excited when she realized we were at that market. They have these little mini pies. So she was like, can I get one? I was like, well, that'll be something <clears throat> I'll see if I can afford at the end. And she ended up grabbing one more. Uh, cool Whip is for the sand pudding. We were like all out of all sizes of Ziploc bags. So it's always weird. They have the quart size and the the gallon size by Ziploc, but they never have it in the sandwich bags. They, you can only get, as you see, this is the name of the market, um, in sandwich bags. They look like they'll be okay, but oh, hopefully it will be. I'm addicted to mangoes this summer, so I grabbed two. Um, we need, need to catch up, and Ben, like, loves ketchup for, like, everything. Um, cream cheese is for the pudding. We only had to buy one dinner, um, which was good because we had some here. We, you know, pushed things back, and um, being tomorrow's my mom's birthday, we didn't need a dinner for that night. So I only needed some sausages. That should be enough for all of us. We got some more rolls, and then we like to have fruit in the house. So I grabbed grapes, which we haven't had in a couple weeks. Just a little bit of watermelon. 
which I think has seeds. And then with the sausage, it's going to be sausage and peppers. And I think I need peppers in the uh, big ziti, I think it called for, I think. And then some brown sugar. Um, I was getting low. It was on the list. And they have, they have a low price. So I was like, well, let me grab this because um, I might make energy balls this week. Not that I need this, but I don't know. So that's all I've got. It costs about $95.98. All right, guys, I just realized I didn't mention my cold cuts. They have it um, already sliced up, and they won't slice it now for you at this small market. Um, but they have quite a bit of options for good prices. So I grabbed buffalo-style chicken breast. Right. I got American cheese, pepperoni, uh, am I saying that right? Ganoia salami. Genoa, something like that. Genoa. Genoa, Genoa salami and honey ham. Um, what's that? Is that Italian, that word? Yeah, so I'm not an Italian. My husband is, and he likes to laugh at me. So, all right. Not bad for all that. So, thanks for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below if my comments are on. I've noticed on both my channels, some videos it's on and some videos it's off. I don't understand why, because it's not like I have music inappropriately on that video when it's turned off. I don't understand. So, YouTube is funny like that now. Um, but, yeah, if you can, leave a comment down below. And don't forget, I'll leave the... Um, the name of our other channel, go check it out where we vlog and you get to see everything we do. Till next time guys, enjoy the glitter.